like the end of chapter three there i might not have had enough time but i'm not i'm not having that be my last one nah. and i mean i'll probably keep going if the run dies it's just like i i come on man like i don't miss shock pad to skip that much i can i'll, I'll get it this time that's the saddest one yeah that was like such a weird angle dumb Oh, it's a synergy. Do all of chapter one and die to the first box clip. Yeah, it's like, at least if you die to therapy skip, like, it's like, okay, that one's hard. GG. Still sucks. Resetting in chapters two or three still sucks. A lot. But. It's just like, man, like, you literally play the entire intro and you miss uh, the easiest one. Like, immediately. It's like, damn. Well, you know what they say, you want to see me do it again? I mean, it's 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 not like this level has nothing going on, but it, it like, kind of, kind of doesn't. Compared to a lot of the other levels in the run, it's, eh. Alright, I am going to refill my water during this uh, cutscene, though, real quick. Okay, all this ammo. All right. Oh my God, Isaac, you made it. They're everywhere. See, uh, Ethan, gone. Nothing I could do. What the fuck are these things? The ones I saw. Some of them were wearing Ishimura uniforms. They're the crew. How the hell can they be the crew? Look at them. We need to get to the bridge. There's a thousand people on board. Someone will be there. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of the quarantine. And you're both repair techs, so how do we do this? There's a broken tram car blocking the tunnel. It's gridlocked the system, and the data board's burned out. I can't lift the lockdown or call the tram until we get a spare from the maintenance bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of a quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And I... Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's a doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Yeah. Yeah, she always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. This is why we gotta just start in Chapter 2 instead. We don't... I don't need to play this level, it's fine. Did I mistime that, or was that just different? Uh, dude, come on. I'll drop it later. Whatever. So we don't want health pack drops, because we're playing in story mode, which is the easiest difficulty, and the game actually heals you automatically after a little bit when you take damage. So, in terms of going fast, we, we really just, we don't want health packs we I, I i pretty much can't use them even if i wanted to i mean i could but i have to kind of go out of my way to do that water refill 100 percent glitchless yeah gotta get that practice in Two more health packs, come on. Sometimes you just get unlucky, I think. Or I've even wondered if... Or it, it almost seems like... Like sometimes when you start to get more health pack drops, you just happen to get more of them that day. I don't know, it's weird. Man, that would be the worst. Imagine having to wait around for 10 minutes before you even get to do this level. 
with about half of that actually just being a cutscene where you can't move. 30 minute chapter 1 dies to shock pad. No. <laughs> you know, I think I think it's always good to have a balance between purity and fun with speedruns. <laughs> Like, yeah, it would be ideal to just start new game and play the entire game, but like... Oh, man. It really is already painful enough resetting an early game in this run. We don't need that. Are you fucking serious, man? And I got a health pack drop again. Dude, I'm getting so unlucky. I thought he almost clipped in there and prevented me from going up the elevator. That would have been just un un unbelievably unlucky, but that didn't happen. So really Wouldn't have been surprised. That was a decent spawn for him to be in. So anything that's not immediately in front of you as you turn the corner, basically. So you have time to kill him. Okay. What? How? I must have shot him just barely too early. So, yeah. Oh, yes. But anyway, to elaborate on what I was saying earlier, yeah. So we don't want health pack drops. We want mostly ammo. Credits are okay. The only thing we're going we're gonna to use credits for in this run is to buy more ammo. So really, we just want cutter ammo. Because even though we are in story and you do get a decent amount of ammo drops. Um, if you don't buy more later, you do definitely run out pretty easily. But yeah, I am definitely considering doing a no reset at this point. Like, I, again, I, I was going to do that last run, but missing shock pad skip, it's like, come on, man. We got to give that at least one more try. Because I don't want to get an amazing run, or like a run that could have PB'd, but then, oh, I missed shock pad skip. You know, that just, that, that would feel really dumb. And that's a pretty rare miss, too. That's a, that's a trick you don't, you, you don't usually see uh, not work. Damn, he didn't die either. Isaac, we made it to the bridge. Get... There's no survivors. Daniels is trying to get into the command computer. But man, I just want to play the rest of the game at this point. I get, I, like, I, 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 sometimes I don't like doing no resets because, like, I just, I'm a little impatient. I just want to get the PB or I want to, want another shot at it, you know. But it is. It is good. It is good to practice. And if I... Like, you just have to kind of push through that feeling sometimes. Because once you actually get to the rest of the game... Haley, I need you to listen. It feels nice to actually play it. The Ishimura's overrun with... The fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? What? No, the comms are still out. Isaac... We need to kill the monsters <gasps> now. Got a damage report? Uh, yeah, it, it's there. Oh, 
Oh, I did have a big idea for a meme time save earlier. I was thinking about it here. So, the the cutscene to blow you up and knock you back here. Does it spawn in when you hit the button? Or does it spawn in there? Because, like, when you grab the cutter, for example, you can kind of, like... Well, it doesn't pull you in as, as instantly as that cutscene does, I think. But you can, like, hit it and then run away very slightly. It'll still pull you right back into it, you know. But I was just thinking about that. Like, what if you could somehow hit the panel and run backwards and get enough distance where you hit the other cutscene as well and maybe it'll skip the first one or like overlap it or something because it just says objective do diagnostics and then it updates after the cutscene plays where it blows you out of the ship you know so or at least i think it does i don't know if you can teleport isaac while you're actually in a cutscene i don't remember but could test it that way also just teleport him. I don't know. There's there's got to be some got to be some kind of skip we can do in chapter 1. In any anything to make that level faster, man. It needs it. I think it's is is it's not the only Is it the only chapter in the game that doesn't have some kind of skip? I think it is. No, it is, right? I can't think of any other I mean there's some levels that don't have a lot of strats, like chapter five you have poison skip and that's Oh well no, you even get the fuse break too, actually. That's a pretty big skip. I mean, that's that's actually that would be chapter five would be like my example of a level that doesn't really have a lot of skips, and that even has two. Hmm. Yeah, I guess so, right? Yeah, it's it is it's the only level in the game that doesn't have some kind of skip, even something small. There we go. Yeah, see, I figured we would get it the next time. But I found a shock pad I could use on the barricade. Just need a hydrazine tank. Hurry, Isaac. I don't like what I'm Like, even if it didn't save that much time, it would be nice if there was some kind of skip just to... Well, it has rig skips, I guess, yeah. I guess that counts. But, also not really. I mean... Yeah, I don't know. I was, like... You know, I, I I guess that would technically count because you are skipping a couple cutscenes, like three, I think, that do actually take a long time. But there's not much effort involved in that. Like I wanna I wanna like physically skip part of the level. Oh, just like clip into zero G at the start. Yeah. Still holding this position. What's happening there? Did you find a cold? No sign of her yet. And I found some high. Almost knocked me off the table. Right. I'll take a second try. Like this isn't gonna be as good as the really good one I had earlier, but I just need to get out of get out of this level. Oh 
Oh man. All right, what do we got? Remember, when you reach the morgue, find Captain Matthias's body. Get his rig codes, and the computer's all ours. I mean, I guess I'm getting better at this level. 357? Like, I can't remember the last time I got sub 4 here. I Honestly, I think it's the prop fly on therapy skip. So I saw some people would look up really high on that, and it seemed to be quicker, so I started doing that. And now that I think about it, I, I'm pretty sure I lose a lot of time on that usually. Do therapy first, door clip to... Comms array and then fly to shock pad. Like clip in the like do the same therapy clip or therapy skip uh clip and then drop down into there or like clip somewhere else. Cause I mean going to shock pad first is pretty fast. But you do have to walk all the way back up. That is one thing I do like about this run, though, is even though it's so restricted by the objectives, there is a lot of, there is a lot, there's a, you have a lot of options for stuff. You know, there's a lot of, there's a lot of cool stuff you can do. A lot of it works, some of it doesn't, obviously, but, you know. It's it just, the, the fact that we could even, like, possibly do something like that, like, even if it's not faster, is still pretty cool, I think. Like, the fact that you can jump between levels. Or areas of the ship like that. Yo, didn't get stuck. This actually might be close to gold or gold, depending on how much time I lost last time getting stuck there. <laughs> Whatever, man. That was even with what second try therapy skit. Huh? That's weird. I don't know what happened like today, at least with chapter two, but I've. I feel like I almost made a breakthrough with saving time there. Because, like, I definitely made some mistakes there, but that's still, like, one of the fastest ones I've gotten. Maybe it was just that prop fly, I don't know. Oh man, this does gold. Not by a lot, but it did. Bro, are you serious? Well, I got a little bit of a boost. That maybe saved time. I don't know. All right, chapter three, my beloved. You'll need your thrusters to reach it, but that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. I do think it's cool though, like considering the fact that you do have to pretty much do every objective in the game, like how many skips there are still. It does remind me of Outlast 2 a little bit in that sense. Like yeah, you do have to kind of do everything, but the game's also broken enough. Where uh... There's still a lot of stress. With a door clip? Yeah, it's something weird with the collision. Maybe it's a health thing? Huh. Like if you're not- wait, like if you're not at full health? That'd be interesting. Change the difficulty to not be on story for that part. <laughs> That's worth a try. I might try that later. I'm pretty sure you can change difficulty mid-game. Except, you know, you can't switch to impossible, but... Seeing you in the control room. Any news on the engines? Yeah. I 
Nice. Alright, well at least that was good. That's nice. I, I still really want to get that fire extinguisher clip more consistent. But I'll take that. Alright, come on, man. I just need to get this skip and we're chilling. This is pretty good so far. Your num number eight is undo splits. Oh, damn. I actually thought mine was uh, switch comparison, but I think I had changed it to something else. Um, you, you also can just move the mouse up as well. I mean, you, I, I, I like the number pad because I know for sure it's only going straight up, but even if you move it left or right a little bit, I'm pretty sure it fixes itself. But, yeah, I mean, if you if you just change, I mean, if you don't mind changing your split key, I guess it's not a bad idea. It is cool. Yeah, don't, don't get me wrong. It's a cool trick. It's like, it's like a lot of things in this run, though. I just wish it was a, a little more consistent. Or at least I knew why it did or didn't work. Oh, you're still alive too. Did I get that? Okay. Can't see. There we go. I still need to get the centrifuge working before we start. Someone okay, come on, man. Move fast, Isaac. Egypt 7 is looking damn close out there. This is so fast. This works. Yes. An actual good chapter 3 for once. Okay, we're actually not, not in there yet. Let's not celebrate too early. Alright, now we're in there. Let's go, dude. 416 there? That's really fast, I think. Like... Yeah, that was really good. <sighs> nice. Numpad to make the 12 hover more consistent yeah that prop does make it a lot easier yeah yeah that was nice but yeah that's that's the first time i've gotten a decent segment there like including the prop fly with all that that's that pretty good oh so glad that i'm glad the, the prop hover worked the, the fire extinguisher clip the the pause buffer like oh, there's just so many things that can go wrong there man all right well i got my wish i guess we're technically not through chapter three yet and i do have to do a fuse break but yeah this unless something goes very very wrong this should be a pretty solid chapter three not perfect but definitely a lot better than the ones i've, I've been getting so yeah. Oh yeah, because you can get fucked in this room. Okay, we did not get trolled. Thank goodness. Yeah. Fortunately, it seems like I have been... The past few times i played, I get at least one decent run past Chapter 3. This one's actually pretty good. Actually, so Chapter 1 was pretty bad, but 2 and 2 I golded. This is probably a gold. Looks like the centrifuge is back online. All that's, left that's true, actually, yeah. It's like, I mean, it's a little bit of a time investment to, you know, lose a run to 2 or 3, or like lose like a minute or whatever. Be like, oh, I'll just go for that later, you know. Because you have to get through Hammond and then um, all that, but. 
Just depends, I guess. Uh, that, that too, yeah. I mean, the advantage of the door clip one is you don't have to carry the box up there. Which definitely would lose, a, like, a little bit. Not a lot if you do it well, I suppose, but... You, you'd definitely be losing a little time grabbing it. Shark with a hat. Yo, what's up? <laughs> Yo, how's it going? Got it. Isaac, fuel storage is unlocked. It'll give you access to the engine chamber. Shit. Okay, there we go. Alright, so I botched that a little bit, but this is still pretty good. It, like I said, that I, I was like, yeah, that can still go kind of eh, but whatever. I'm pretty sure this still golds, though. It's gotta. I mean, I guess it, it it's possible it won't, but I feel like it does. This guy's not dead. That didn't kill him. My God, we're all just gonna terrible fight. Goodness. Did I get it? There we go. Oh my goodness. Okay, so well. The actual stuff that usually kills my run, the skips, were pretty good. That was a little sloppy, but I also didn't get the best spawns. Isaac, you did it. The Ishimura's moving again. No thanks to ever. Train a rat to be like a little ratatouille. Yeah, you, you should do that. <laughs> good luck. Ah <laughs> oh, man, not even sub ten. So bad. Does this even gold actually now? I don't know if it does actually. I might be losing time. Oh no no no! I'm not losing time actually no. Ah, uh, no, this gold's by a couple seconds. <laughs> For a second. Not the puker, are you serious, dude? Isaac, you disable the tram lock. Bro. Or the spitter, whatever the fuck. Alright. Dumb. Whatever, I'm... Uh, it's fine. Yo, what's up, Demonic Box? Finally got around to beating uh, this game, so you can finally watch speedruns. Yo, nice. I, d I do like to do that. It's Sometimes I want to finish the game first before I watch speedruns, you know, no spoilers or whatever. But yeah, welcome on in. If, if, if you haven't seen any of the run yet, um, it's pretty wild. We are about to watch a cutscene, though. <laughs> well, not a cutscene, but, you know, if you consider standing around for like two minutes. A cutscene, then. Yeah, but. Nah, this, this level has some cool strats, too. Once we get to chapter 6, that's when it really picks up. Well, 7 especially is when it picks up. But. Yeah, chapter 6 is when it starts to get really cool. I mean, the, the two levels we just did are both pretty cool as well, but. It's always the same spawns in this room. Wait, really? 
I thought it was... Wait, the, the, the engine room? I feel like there's some places they'll sometimes show up and sometimes they won't, right? Oh, yeah, well, I mean, like, um... Yeah, it's the same number of enemies, but, like, w like where they actually spawn is, is random, yeah. No, no, keep that rifle close. That? Remake clears OG. I think, I think it does, yeah. Like, the original is a good game, obviously, but... This game just improves on so many things, yeah. Like, if I, if I were to just recommend someone to get into the series for the first time... I would I would recommend them play this over the original. It's like if you really like the series and you want to go back and play all of them, then like definitely still play it. But yeah, doing RE seven runs, we get uh, annoying on a skip. Is it the one where Jack like throws you out of bounds on the stairs? I, I actually did run RE seven for a little bit. Um, wanted to get back into it, but I remember that was a little annoying. We're gonna fix this hammock. It is. It is that one. Yeah. It's it's a it's a little weird. Yeah. It's been a while since I did it, but yeah. Yo, what's up, Laura Weaver? I actually did buy that on Steam. At least I think so. It's like the HD remaster or whatever. Or is it a remake? It is a remake. Yeah. Or was it the? Or did I buy the OG? I don't know. I bought. I I bought one of them on Steam. <laughs> Gotta play it. <sighs> Six slashers as soon as you walked in a room yesterday. That's awesome, dude. <laughs> oh, you think you think extra can spawn? Okay, because usually it's six slashers and one leaper for that room. You switched the FPS back too late. Oh, wait, like the part where you um. Oh, you like when he grabs you? I guess yeah. Planning to play a bunch of horror stuff this month. Nice, nice. What are you What are you thinking? Oh, like RE0, yeah. Yeah, I haven't played that one. Oh, look, we, we almost got 139. Some of best. I think once I get a good chapter 7, we will. Or like 138. Oh, Alien Isolation is fun. I like that game. Yeah, I do want to get back into RE7 at some point. It's not like at the top of my list, but I do I do want to do want to try it again. I'd have to kind of relearn the entire run though, which is the only problem. <laughs> like runs like this that I've grinded a lot more. It's like I do have to kind of relearn the whole game, but it's a lot faster and I remember a lot more. With RE7, it's like I wasn't that good at RE7. I mean, I got pretty okay at it for like the couple weeks that I that I that I grinded it, but like yeah. I got a lot better at this game than I did that game, so it was easier to get back into this. Oh, nice. That was good. Good RNG there. Nice. Power diverted from mining administration network. That's one. Still need more power. First stream in 10 years. Bro, you're gonna complain about me not streaming in two days and you're gonna show up three hours late? I'm just saying. I don't know, man. That's a little... <laughs> like, are you really trying to watch the stream? I don't know. I'm not convinced. Nice. Didn't get bad RNG. My load speeds. I really do need to get Rivet Tuner to work, but that works for now. Okay, I'm seeing a power reroute from the electrical system. Just watch the outlets. 
Mm, you had college things to do. Okay, all right. I see. Bro, I swear though, I actually just don't stream for two days and you guys are like, oh my god, he never streams. He's literally never online. When was the last time you guys streamed? Actually, Sim streams a decent amount now, to be fair. To be fair. Having shit to do? The crew thought it was a... Bro, don't call people females. I know you're joking, though, but like... <laughs> uh, yeah. Hey, man, I have a full-time job. I got shit to do. Need my fix. Also, you have to town noob. Hey, listen, guys, I like streaming, okay? I, I really enjoy streaming, but sometimes I have other stuff to do also. You streamed instead, and then they showed up and asked you to play Valorant? SMH. I mean, hey, Valorant's fun, too. But we space gaming. What? Wait. No, 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 dude. Like, what the fuck? Hold on a second. How did that happen? What causes this rig video to play? Because, like, I literally, like, I pulled that shit up so fast, and he, like... Bro, you've been tempted to run Outlast? Oh, you should. Yeah, it's really fun. It's pretty easy to learn, too, depending on what, what category. Bro, that's, like, 20 seconds. Like, what the fu Nah, okay, hold on. Does anybody actually know what causes that rig video to play? Because sometimes that shit plays, like, so long after you, you like, switch the thing over. Like, is it is it tied to killing that first enemy there? What's the plan? I'll seek no way, right? Isn't it a delay after turning on the power? I thought so. Door skip time? I might try it once for the meme. Maybe not, actually. Because, like, did you guys see how fucking fast that showed up? Like, literally, I killed the guy, I walked over, I hit the thing, and I just, like, immediately started pulling up the rig to skip that shit after I opened the door. And it played the rig video immediately. Like, I've seen people, and I've done it myself, where it's like, it's like, do the power, kill both enemies, open the door, start walking down the hallway, then do it. And it still doesn't show up immediately. Like, there, there's there gotta be something else. Like, I, I don't know if you're, if you're still here, Quinn. If you know, but like, bro, that's so dumb. I hate that rig video, man. Uh, also, yo, Cash, thank you so much for the eight months, by the way. I really appreciate it. Hope you're doing good. You think the menu bugs out sometimes? I don't think the rig was playing. Maybe not. Maybe I should have just mashed. I don't know. If you cool the swollen fast enough before the enhanced drops, it might fire quickly. Okay. Cause like, I, I just keep having this problem where it's like, I do need to kill both enemies, but like, I mean, I, do I actually have to kill the pregnant one? I don't actually know. I usually just keep doing it, but I don't know if you have to. Uh, it might trigger if the room's cleared, but I didn't kill the slasher though. Like, I keep wanting to take that rig video safe. And then I keep trying to- I like- I tr I literally tried to take it so safe there. And it play- it fi- it felt like it fired so early. Unless the menu was bugged and it wasn't actually- are you serious? Please. No, dude, I press- Like, I pressed stasis and he didn't do it. Uh, I hate chapter 5, dude. That's why I killed a slasher, because he'll do that shit. Alright, well, we're still pretty far ahead, but- You can let the first rig play and then skip the last two. Oh, like in the elevator? I actually didn't know you could skip the first one and... Or like let the first one play and skip the others. I thought they kind of just played like back to back. Okay. Oh, man. Alright, well, I mean, that was like a pretty okay chapter four. I did still lose like 20 seconds, though. I better not get this tram crash. I'm gonna be so mad.
That is actually a lot. Yeah. Especially for a level like this where you, like, I mean, there's not a whole lot going on. Except for dumb bullshit at the beginning. I mean, yeah, still. So, wait, so you let the first one play out, get in the elevator, and then you skip the other ones? Okay, I'll have to, I'll have to, like... I, I, I'd actually want to practice it first, probably, just because, like, I don't want to fuck it up. Oh, dude, I'm so mad about the Chapter 4 one still. It's so dumb. Like... Literally, it played so early. Like, I don't know. I want. I want to figure out what actually causes that shit to play. Cause it's it. It's not. It doesn't feel like it's the same every time. I don't know. After the Kellyan explodes, if the area is cleared of enemies, the rig plays early. Maybe. Well, because, like, I used... What I used to do... Oh, I also saw Rampancy do this autosave reload here. I don't know if this is actually faster. I guess I'll do it. Oh, yeah, I'm sure, th I'm sure there's a way to, like, set it up consistently. I just don't know, like... Right. That does make sense. It, it probably is actually because I'm killing the pregnant first. There we go. Because I, well, I used to go straight for the power, then I'd try to kill both of them, open the door, then try to skip the rig video. Sometimes I would miss it, and I'm like, okay, so I'll just not kill the slasher first. I don't know. It's because of soft lock. It's not fast. Oh, okay, okay. I, I was wondering why you did that, but that, that actually makes sense, yeah. I mean... I haven't been soft locking here, but I mean, I don't mind playing it safe. Um, okay. Well, thanks though. That's 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 good to know. Um, but I yeah I start, so I started doing it that way because it's like okay I'll, like I need to at least kill the slasher. I don't know if the pregnant can get stuck in the elevator or not, but it's like I'll at least. It's like, I'll kill that guy first, he's not in the way, then do the power. Because I thought it was after you turn the power on, it was on a timer. So it's like, I'll just do that, go to the door, skip... The, I don't know, like, at this point, it's like, I'm just gonna... I, I actually might just turn the power on and immediately just pull up the rig and just sit there by the door. Skip it, open the door, kill them, go through. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm, I honestly am probably just gonna start doing that, because fuck that, dude. Ugh. <sighs> But even if I was to ask, I suspect you're not the- I, I think you can still get the soft lock, even if you do go over to the lift. And I haven't fully um, the cause of death. I haven't had it happen since coming back to this game, but... Well, I, I want to say it, it's all, it all could just be not, like, placebo. It could be not true, or like a coincidence or whatever. But I swear on some of those cutscenes, like the one that crashes in Chapter 12, I think if you, like wait just a split second before interacting with it it's a little more likely to not get stuck or crash i do that on this one sometimes i'll wait like just a split second and then hit it but i don't know if that actually matters oh i see what you're saying yeah i think you still have to do it to load the hunter in but i'm not sure i don't really remember I just thought I, I thought I remembered it was possible to get him to not spawn. Alright. But yeah, so I'll, I'll have to practice that chapter 4 rig thing again. Or I'll just do it, like I said, just take it super safe. Because I'm tired of missing that. Oh, this is kind of off topic, but I just remembered. You, you guys remember that clip of somebody um flipping through a wall while getting hit by the swarm? We can't use that anywhere, can we? <laughs> Seems pretty situational. Right? Yeah, it is. Just, yeah, because if you if you don't, you gotta wait a lot longer. 
Yeah, because uh, making him regenerate causes the rig video to play pretty much right after. Waiting for the day I die to that guardian somehow. Yeah, I mean, you got Swarm in Chapter 7 here. I don't know where in Chapter 5 you'd really want to do it. for him to clip the door before the rig video plays. Keep this form in seven alive. Get in the room for quarantine skip, maybe? Yeah. Can you see the same thing? You'd have to dodge them throughout, like, every other time you came back, though, which would be a little obnoxious, but I mean, maybe. That's something I might try after this run if I do have time. I'm not sure. It depends on what time. It'll be almost midnight by the time this runs over if I finish it, so. I'm not sure actually how much glitch hunting I'm going to do, but I might try to get like a, like a super, super rough timing of doing quarantine skip clipping out the other, like clipping back into zero G and flying back out J just to see like, would it even be worth trying to find this? But it is kind of hard to get a like a, a decent timing of it without really having like a setup to get there, and I haven't figured that out yet. Because I haven't found a spot yet you can just fly straight in there. But, I don't know, I haven't messed with it that much. Uh, yeah, actually I will do that too. But yeah, you would need to fly towards the beginning of it, right? Because, or you just need a, you need a box. Unless, 
there's a way to fly straight to the rig and then do beacon skip in a different way, but I don't know. It totally works. I bet it does. What exactly is it we do that unlocks the tram to hydroponics? Is it just unlocking it at mining? It's interesting. I mean, I, I guess that's the only thing that's different now. I wonder if it's just because it's further in the in the game. Oh man, Looney, I was just thinking about this. So we haven't, because we haven't really routed all missions at all yet, right? But I do remember you have to backtrack through medical a little bit. So I'm wondering if there's some out of bounds you could do to speed that up at all. Like do shock pad skip again. Because, <laughs> well, it depends on when you do it too. Oh, I should be doing this first. I think opening the crew deck opens all of them. Yeah, I finished the I mean, depending on what the routing is, that could be an option. They must have been trying to kill whatever Yeah, we just gotta do a lot of testing. Cause it's what it's it's the one where you gotta like backtrack through medical a bunch. Isaac, the hydroponics tram station is sealed up. Oh, I could have cut that way closer. Um There's the one where you gotta grab all the rigs. That one actually I don't think you have to do it in any real order, right? I would think. I don't remember how it works. It might just be collect them all, so you just get them. I mean, some of them you can get as you go. Like the chapter four one, you know, you get while you do that. There's the one in chapter six you get as you go. No order needed. Yeah, so I mean that, that we can kind of just do however we want, I would assume. But you do have to get back to the, make the master override thing on the bridge, I guess. But I don't know. I hope there's some cool all mission strats, or at least the route is interesting. I'd like to try a run if it's cool. What's the other one? Nicole's? Yeah, Nicole's mi side mission, yeah. I've only done all the missions once or twice, casually. So, it'll be interesting going through that. But I'm, I'm sure there's probably some cool skips we can do. Oh, I guess if there is one in the crew deck, yeah, we'd have to get that at some point. Like, that'd be, that'd be cool, actually actually going in the crew deck, even if very briefly, you know? Just to get the item, you know, not, not doing the whole level, probably. I don't even remember where the one in crew deck is, actually. Uh oh. Oh my god. I thought I thought I only killed one like uh or I thought I didn't get any of them when I was dead. Man, that would have been bad. I hope that doesn't mess up my stasis routing now. I don't remember if it does. I don't know. Oh no, no we're fine actually, no. We're good. Oh, yeah, yeah, that one. Okay, so no, that's not even like in the crew deck, it's, like, I guess.
the door. Also, I remember there was a strat you could do on this bridge where you could just fall off. Oh god. And I want to say it was possible to dodge the quarantine, but I think you have to do the quarantine no matter what. But it would maybe save a little time over taking the lift. Really? Damn, I never missed that. I mean, maybe the second one, but yeah, the first one's pretty easy. You can beat Dead Space 2 faster than you can beat the first six levels in this game. <laughs> it's funny. Just looking at that, my best is like 59, 30 or 20 something after chapter 6 I think. Wait, is he still alive? What the f- Get down there. Oh, not like this. Come on, dude. Get off the railing. Come on, dude. No way. Get down. Get down, dude. I fucking- I can't believe it, dude. It's so bad. Like, ugh. Why do I keep losing so- like, not every run. Like, my PB was fine, but like, dude, can I stop losing a minute to this trick? It's not that hard. Ugh. Ugh. Whatever. I mean, if I can get to chapter 7, I can make up that time, but that's stupid. Whatever. Just don't softlock, man. Come on. I still don't know what causes the softlock here, either. Alright. So, like, what the fuck? Why did I land... Like, I feel like I'm aiming right at it. I don't know why sometimes you, like... Oh, Alright, didn't softlock. I think I know what I did different on the flying part there. It's, eh. That's fine.
I really need to stop losing a minute in chapter six. This is so stupid. No, it's expelling all its gas reserves. It must be close. Isaac, finish it off. Oh, man, it just uh, what? Well, what? Well, yeah, whatever. Losing, I'm actually losing like a minute and a half or two minutes. Yeah. God. Well, I can gold by at least a minute and a half in chapter seven, so there's that, I guess. Look at it that way. Nah, okay. I keep wanting to see if you can just skip that one as well. I think it might be fast. I usually don't skip it, but I feel like it's got to save at least a second. What is this, OG? I know, right? Like, it, it's not the most free skip or, like, level in the world, but, like, man, of all the levels to lose that much time, like, come on, dude. <laughs> come on. Well, whatever. We actually made it to the good part of the run. Let's see what we can do. OG6 gives you nightmares? That level sucks, dude. I mean, it's a cool skip, but god, dude, like, it's it's not, like, the, it, the worst part is just the fact that the door doesn't unlock on the way out. Because, like, actually getting into the boss room early is not that bad, but oh my god, getting out of there is just the worst thing. It's just so trash. Would you would you say that's what that's the chapter in in OG that gives you the most nightmares? It's got to be up there, right? I mean, there's 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 a lot of really annoying levels in that game, <laughs> but yeah. You think so? Yeah. I don't blame you, honestly. I mean, there are some that I almost would say are worse, but I mean... Oh, dude, no, you're right. No, no, you're, you're actually... I forgot about that, you're right. You can get the best Chapter 6 of all time, and the game can crash in like three or four... It can crash in like three spots. And then it can crash in chapter 7, like, right after that. It's so bad, dude. It's, like, it's so bad. God, it's like... 
OG already has enough things that make it frustrating, but the crashes on PC just suck so bad, dude. Like, the cr I fucking... The last time I tried to PB in Glitchless, I couldn't because it crashed in Chapter 10, dude. Like, at the end. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I usually grab the other box for this, but I can't imagine it actually matters. Fucking dickhead. Okay. Yeah, I got the shit launch. Unlucky. If you don't get a lot, of, it's like, yeah, because if you don't get a lot of speed, you just like, I don't know. At least uh, the auto saves right there. Dude, really? Oh, that works, okay. Never mind. It did, that also looked like a weird launch, but that's fine. Why does it do that? Okay. Sometimes you stand in a corner and it just doesn't think you're in zero G anymore. I mean, you aren't, but I, I don't know why. I should test if it's better to fly a little bit more left or a little bit less there. Nice loony fly. Thanks, yeah. I mean, we gotta make sure we land in the right spot, but yeah, that deload was good. It was nice. Nice movement getting there, too. It's really easy to bonk on shit. Finally turned the game into Dead Space 2, yeah. There's a couple skips like this now, yeah, where you count, like, in the dark. Nice. I do still need to double check if you actually need to skip this or if just clipping in the next room counts. Because I think it might just skip it if you deload the level. I didn't aim in the right spot for that. Oh, fuck. There we go. Okay. All right, I'll take that. Uh, I'm gonna wait for this. Actually, that'll be perfect. Yeah. What? Is that rig video still playing? Okay. It might have been a visual glitch from skipping the other one, maybe. I don't know. I'm glad we worked out this whole sequence here. This is really cool. Is no More fun than dragging the battery, that's for sure. <laughs> the bay Help. That was weird. Okay. Do you guys like flying in the void? How about another one? But yeah, this is what I was talking about earlier. It's nice how, um... Even though we gotta still kinda do everything, the game is still pretty busted. 
terms of the amount of tricks, like glitches and shit. Let's fucking go, dude. Okay, that was nice. <laughs> that was clean. Of course, Just move. All right. All right. I feel like we still had some weird flubs here and there, but. Looney fly on, that was pretty pretty good. Well, battery skipped that uh, first clip wasn't great, but Alright, yeah, definitely not perfect, but we're getting sub 10 at least. It's like, uh, grab a box. <laughs> Almost forgot. Yeah, I think you can get like 9 flat, is what Rampancy was saying, or maybe even faster. So, like, I still lost a shitload of time, but much better. And, like, we cleaned up the second half of that level, we cleaned that shit up pretty nicely for the most part. Pacing of some of these levels very evocative Dead Space 2, just trick after trick. I agree, yeah. Really, it's like once you get to 7, it just blasts into high gear, man. Um. Oh my god, I was like, am I fucking stuck in this? Okay. Yeah, that level, that's a, that's a Dead Space 2 kind of level, for sure. It does, yeah. Like, chapter 6 is where I feel like it starts to pick up, but the level's still pretty long. And, like, the main trick isn't really still until the end, you know? It's, like, pretty straightforward. Well, I mean, you have the, like, the tentacle skip, I guess. But, like, yeah, what, chapter 7, like, dude, it's so quick. We gotta skip this tram. Yeah, we really gotta figure out if it's faster to do that or not. With zero G or something. It's possible. Well, maybe. I don't know. Could be possible. Prop fly down the whole tunnel? Oh no. That would look cool. At least. Nice. Let's go. Fucking way. Please, please, just work correctly. No, no. Wait, what? Oh, oh no. Oh no. Wait. Oh man. Wait, did I get this backwards? Bro, what the fuck? Oh, where's the piece, man? There it is. God, I don't even want to know. I don't want to know how much time I lost to that. Where am I going? Where am I going? Dude, what the fuck? I think you got it. Try opening a channel to the Valor. 
All right, well, hopefully we get the chapter nine box clip to fucking get that time back that I just threw. And skip was first try too, like come on. Alright, that's fine. I could save 30 seconds in the next level, 30 and 30 and 10, that's that's crazy. Oh dude, I remember yeah, no, that's like three times saving 10, because I that's something really dumb happened. That that actually makes up for it. Can't play the actual game, I know. That would be. Yeah, I don't know. That's usually I usually don't have that much problem with the puzzle. It's usually I do it the same way, but I just got mixed up. Ugh. I had to have lost at least like thirty to that though. Whoa. All right. We're still in this though. So. I had actually... I hadn't thought about that. Maybe. Poison skip too. No? Oh, you've tried? Okay. one of those shots hit. Yo, what's up, last drop? Wait, why did... Oh, I see. Okay, I was like, wait, why did I skip this split? And I lost a minute on chapter 12, too. Yeah, okay. So, I mean, like, I got time to save. Man, I fucking smacked that into my tooth. Oh, yeah, I actually really shouldn't stay up too late. Today, I have a... I go to the dentist tomorrow. Before work. Not much. Nice, nice. Glad you're chilling. It's already counting down by a lot. Uh, I'm, Isaac, I'm on board. The really hoping I get that. This box clip, man. I really need it. The hell was that? It's probably not required to PB, but it would really help. Alright, I think we don't skip the rig video also. Isaac, we have a problem. The Valor's carrying a 12 megaton warhead. The crash hit the torpedo bay hard. And if the game crashes, then my ass is grass. And, uh, whatever. I guess. 12 megatons? You know I'm not a nuclear engineer, right? I don't need you to be. Just stabilize the warhead and eject it away from the engine. The soldiers must have had... No crash. Nice. When they return, those units merge right into their bodies. Chase them. They're fucking fast, I think. They start. I'm gonna skip kind, fuck you. Nice.
really. Okay. Should still be able to make this. No fucking way. No way, dude. What am I doing? God. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's fine. Alright. It's like Looney said, can I try basic menu in? Can we play the game? Another malfunction. After you some words in the red. Someone get the door open. Let's go. Okay. Saving some time at least. Yeah, man, I'll take third try. Ah, <laughs> uh, maybe. We did fuck up some other stuff, so I don't, I'm not sure. Like, missing that fire cycle was kind of bad. I'm actually not sure how much. Did we even miss it? Or, like, or... I don't know. I, I don't know if I had to wait like a full extra one or not. Yeah, we'll see. I mean, third try is still... What the f... Okay. Something pushed me. Hey, I'd love to save 20 seconds at least. Pretty cool. Just got back. Welcome back. I'd say we're still at least on 142 pace. Bro, no way I did actually lose like 50 seconds in chapter 8 though. Whatever. Hey, look at that. Alright. Oh nice, that was good. Alright, I, I needed that. That was good. Just need to not fuck this up. I really do actually need to practice that. I know I just got that, but I do need to practice that because I don't have the exact angle down. And I, I got a little... I feel like I got a little lucky. Kind of popped out pretty quick. But that was nice. That was a little close, actually. Not a fan of how close that was, but we got it, so whatever. Yeah. It's just like... I mean, all the levels are just so good after, like, Chapter 7 onwards, they're just all so fast. Like, I, I wish the first six were a little more like the latter, the latter half, you know? Two, chapter 2 is okay. It's hard, but like, yeah, 2 is fine. 3 also has some cool skips, but it's still sort of long. If we could skip decontamination in 3, that would that would be cool. I guess, like, 4 has cool stuff too. It's just like the Hammond cutscene, you know? I, don't know? I guess 11 does have some parts you kind of got to like wait around a little bit. But... It's not too bad after all these really fast levels. Green, hey, yeah, we're ahead again. If I can hit this box clip, we're in good shape. And we didn't tram crash, okay. Alright. 
If I get this box clip, I can save a lot of time. I do have to get that to be on 142 pace, though. I gotta get a pretty solid chapter 11. Yeah, let's definitely kill that guy, because I know he's... I, I, I don't know, but I'm pretty sure he's gonna be there on the way back. Same with this fucker. Decent RNG. Did I actually get all the tentacles? Okay. I need to switch to this. I have a shitload of ammo. Wait, they made it. No, 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 we're good. Okay. Alright. I figured those guys were going to be here on the way back, so we're going to have to take care of them anyway. Don't soft lock in this lift. Wait. No way. No fucking way, man. Like, fuck off. So dumb. Also, please. Thank you. Alright, that was some horse shit. Please. 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 <sighs> okay. It's fine. I fucking okay. If it loads slow enough or some dumb I don't know what causes it, but you actually can get through the door there, but you do need to finish this to progress, I'm pretty sure. Open the door, open the door. Okay. Okay. Let's go, dude. Second try. My name is Kendra Daniel. That makes up for it. That was good. I'm still kind of- oh no no, actually I think I'm good on ammo now. I was just worried I was running a little low, but... This is the last regular combat room we have to do, I guess besides the final boss with some of the enemies there. 
All right, well, we got to run ahead to chapter 12 with a minute to save there, so we got a chance, but again, yeah, it just comes down to the... It's like any run, it comes down to 12. We could just get wrecked. And if so, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I guess. There is, I shouldn't jinx myself, but I think I've gotten it first try like every run that I've done since coming back or something like that. Like sometimes it gives me trouble, but it's been okay. No fucking way, dude. Oh, it was already in place. Okay, I thought he was blocking it to be honest, but whatever. God, just like so many dumb things happening. You're right though, we're not we're not technically out of here yet. Three shots, dude. Wait, did I turn the gravity off? There we go. Okay. Like that second that second try clip is kinda gonna carry us <laughs> for this level. So, I could get some ammo from these lockers on the left, but they've been giving me credits every time, so I'm not holding my breath on that. But, I mean, really I don't need that much ammo. I need contact beam ammo for the first phase of the boss, which I haven't, like, plenty for that. And then you just get a bunch of boxes with ammo and stuff, so I think I'm actually chilling. You cleared the way. I can always help. Not this time. I... Don't need that stasis pack. I guess I could just burn it now, but I'll save it. She left us to die. There's still hope. You can recall the shuttle and the little pilot from here. Bring back the marker and you can return it to Aegis. Oh man, I just remember I lost a minute and a half in chapter six. That is so tragic. This actually would be record pace if I didn't do that. If I didn't get stuck on that stupid little ledge. <laughs> That's alright though. This run overall is definitely a lot better than my PB, so that's all that really matters right now. There we go. Credits. Maybe that's a fixed drop. I don't know. I do have time, actually. I think there's lockers over here, too. Oh, no. I guess that's OG, maybe. Okay. Uh, there's lock- there's locker here. Oh, two things- oh, okay, only one of them dropped shit, okay. Alright, now we can officially say we gotta run to chapter 12. Ahead. Let the RNG be in our favor. Alright, yeah, so this is definitely still 142 pace. Oh shit, some of best 139.21. I guess that chapter 7 gold did did save me a lot of time. I, I didn't even see that till now. Nice. Yeah, 138, some of best pretty soon, I think. This isn't how I imagined saying goodbye to the 
If this does PB, it'll be so easy to be ahead out of Chapter 6, though, I think. Well, getting run past Chapter 3 is always hard, but... I lost so much in 5 and 6 to, like, dumb stuff that I usually don't lose time to. No. But, I mean, it's a long run. Stuff's gonna balance out. Like, that was the best 7 I've had by a lot. It's easier when there's no 10 was great. 8 fucking sucked, too. I forgot about that. I wonder if we'll ever get this game sub 130 as well. I'm thinking about that. Like we're we're gonna break the the next 10 minute barrier, like getting to the 130s pretty soon. But if you're not ready, miracle, I'm just wondering if we'll make it make it to one sub 120 or sub 130. I mean, you know, Hungry. we'd have to we'd have to find a lot of strats for that though. Like, we can definitely cut this down a little bit into the 130s, especially with, like, some of the, like, like big booty skip, some of the stuff that isn't in the record yet. But, I mean, that's also, like, right now, that's really inconsistent. So, I don't know. Yeah. I think it could maybe happen someday. We, we would have to see a lot of significant strats, though. Yeah, unless, I, I kind of agree. Unless we find, like, another major, major sequence break, that probably would be the last 10-minute barrier, but you never know. All right, this is cool. There we go. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. So, Come on. I can still make it before she leaves. No! Wait! Yes! Oh shit! Okay, that was that was so fucking sketch. Alright, come on. Yes! Oh my god. Oh let's go, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, hold on, wait. Oh fuck off. Please, Isaac! The hive mind is coming! You have to make a call! Wait, what? Oh my god, I fucking broke the ten <gasps> I choked. Wait, I think that canceled her rig video here. Okay, that was fucking stupid. Wait, this will still work, right? Bro, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? No, dude. No. <laughs> Bro. Like, what the fuck? How do you choke that hard, dude? How did I hit the fucking tentacle, dude? All right, whatever. Um, there's still PBs, right? Right? I mean, that was a good skip as long as I didn't lose like a minute, or I would have had to have lost like two minutes on that skip to not PB. So I think we're good. God, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Oh my god, when he started walking off and he got stuck, I was like, it's over. But then he made it. The box hit the weak point and break it? Yes. Yes, and it spawned the enemies. Like, what? Like, how unlucky is that? How do you choke the last box skip that bad? It's because I didn't grab it right away, and then, it, and then it fucking hit that shit, too. Whatever. Oh, true, actually, yeah. That, that, is, that is some free time save. 
Yeah, no, this is definitely still PD. If uh, we if we get a good boss fight, we don't mess it up. So we're not done yet, but nice. I played it really safe on the on the skip too. Once I grabbed the box, I was like, I'm not throwing it. I'll just grab it, which did also lose me a lot of time, but. Nice. Ow. Wait, actually, I do want to be on the side of it. Okay. Assuming it doesn't go away. I don't remember. Let's go, dude. All right, we got a PV. Scuffed. But we did. Oh, not even 142 either, actually. Yeah, but hey, 143, I guess. Whatever. GG. Uh, whatever. I haven't played in two days, so at least we got something. Again, losing like a minute on this level, even though it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I'll, I'll, de I'll definitely take it. Th yeah, thank you for the GG's, guys. I appreciate it. Oh. All right, 143.16. Nice. Uh. Uh. <laughs> well, I didn't mean it that way. I just. Uh, just glad I, I'm just I'm just glad cuz like this was supposed to, like it didn't seem like I was gonna get anything going but we we did clutch it Ugh. well I have well yes I haven't played in the past two days but I have been playing the past like few weeks like almost every day so I'm still pretty practiced I just I don't know uh, some weird things. I, I I feel like I am still improving a lot though. Every time I sit down to play, it's just like whenever stuff goes wrong in two in chapters two and three, it just feels like oh my god, I suck. I can't like <laughs> I can't do it. But I don't know. Once you get past chapter three, it just it gets a lot easier. I think. Let's go. Man. Like, it's, I, I, yeah, we're, it's just like, I, we're, we're, yeah, we are still improving a lot, and I can definitely see, like, a much better time, like, soon, especially if chapter 12 isn't, like, terrible, because, yeah, like, I lost, I lost, like, what, like, 40 or 50 seconds on that stupid puzzle in chapter 8, a lot, like, a, a lot of the, a lot of the biggest time losses were just silly stuff that I could fix next time, like, we did actually clutch a lot of the hard stuff, which feels nice, at least, like, at least, that stuff is working. There's still some stuff I really hope continues to be more consistent. Like, you know, the chapter 9 clip, like, I'm starting to get to the point where, like, I do definitely need to get that. Like, I, I don't know if it would straight up kill my run if I don't get it next time, but pretty soon. You know, um, and thank you for the GG's as well. I appreciate it. <sighs> yeah. Another, another minute break, though. For me, at least. Um... 
Uh, by that, I mean the, the record's down to 141. Actually, I don't remember the, like, down to the seconds what it is. It's not on speedrun.com yet, so that's why it, it hasn't updated on the, the splits. 141.33. Yeah, okay. So, it's like a mid-141. 139 pretty soon, though, I think, at least. Yeah, sub-140. Sub I'm pretty sure Rampancy's gonna get it pretty soon. Oh, we could get it pretty soon, too, but it just depends on how much time we have to play. Like, I'm I'm getting to the point where I could maybe get it, but I would... I need to clean up some segments still a lot. And it just has to... It, it would also have to be a really good run, too. Even even with, like, a one... Even if I got my Summer Best down to, like, 137, it would still... That'd still be a really good run. Yeah, I could see 137. You might need Big Booty Skip for that, though. And that would... Like, yeah, and like assuming everything goes perfectly is pretty tough because like there are some tricks that are a little random still, and on top of stuff that's just hard. So getting nailing all the hard tricks while also getting good luck is not easy. Hey, I didn't get any tram crashes this run though. At least that's nice. I guess. <laughs> Hopefully it continues to be like that. But yeah, I'm, pr I'm pretty happy with that. Um, I'm going to do some more runs tomorrow, so hopefully we'll, we'll get something. But yeah.